What is up guys, it's your boy Andy Matrix and this is actually pretty cool. I actually found a manga artist who is, um, well another manga artist who's, um, who's against political correctness, right? And apparently this is not the first time that this manga artist has actually um, spoken up against political correctness. Um, I'm, I'm gonna get to that in a moment. But I actually think it's really cool um, that these manga artists are speaking up because, you know, because in Japan is a country that has creative freedom and they do not like it when, you know, when people in the West try to like dictate or try to control their, their creative freedom, right? So, guys, before we get started, make sure that you subscribe to the channel. Make sure you hit the notification bell for future notifications. I talk about anime, manga, video games, geek culture, Japanese culture. If you're into any of that stuff, then make sure to subscribe. Now with the show. Okay, so the name of the manga artist is Kenta Shinohara, who is the creator. Yeah, he's the manga artist of a manga called Sket Dance. And another manga called Witch Watch. Witch Watch? Well, those are two, two mangas that he has made. And he made a post on social media. Right, and actually I'm going to show you the image right here. And it's basically like a panel from his uh, Witch Watch manga. So, and the panel says... Um, I don't care, I don't care, I don't care about political correctness, I don't care about times or whatever, just hit bad guys, right? <laughs> Absolutely cool. So basically, um, I'm not sure what motivated him to uh, to make this post, but I think it's, yeah, it's, it's, it's uh, I absolutely agree. And apparently it's not the first time that he's, uh, he's actually spoken up against like political correctness, right? But um, he also defended the controversy with Ozaki Chan. Remember when Ozaki Chan was being attacked? Uh, this was in 2020 during the pandemic. You know, people were attacking Ozaki Chan because she thought she was a minor, despite of the fact that the story itself said that she was in college, right? So we don't have to go through all of that. So three years later, you know, the uh, the manga artist is still, you know, against political political correctness, which is I think is really cool. And we need more manga artists like this. And um, a lot of people in the comment section of the Twitter post were actually, you know, agreeing with him on his side about the whole the whole situation. So that was pretty much it for this video, guys. A pretty short video. I just wanted to talk about this really cool because, you know, I, I like it when, you know, more artists speak against this stuff, you know, it's just really cool. So uh, whatever your thoughts are, make sure to comment below. Make sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell for future notifications. It's your boy, Andy Matrix. Godspeed.